Hey guys, I am back today with another Walmart clearance video. Now, if you have not watched the other three videos that I posted, I'll definitely link them down below so you can get all the way caught up. Now, with that being said, Walmart has a lot of clearance items right now that are a dollar or less. And I'm gonna put this disclaimer out there. I am not encouraging you to go out and shop. However, if you happen to be there, you can definitely pick up a few items, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and get started. First things first is they have these actual sunglasses. So they have Lilo and Stitch, they have Harry Potter, all of these. Now guys, guess what? They are saying $3, but on our handy dandy app, they are ringing up $1. Yes, $1. So if you need those for the children, definitely grab them. Hopefully we'll be out for the summer, you know, and be able to enjoy the nice weather. Now I am touching this one because I am going to buy it. This is a velvet headband, and I love how bedazzled it is. Headbands are trending right now, and it says that it's $3, but guess what? It is $1. So I did show you the barcode, so if you want to check the app, you can check the app and see if your store has them as well. But they had a lot of hair accessories that were $1 on the ticket. It says $3, but if you scan it on the app or even an in-store scanner, they are ringing up $1. So definitely pick up you some. Now, with that being said, a lot of these look like they are the winter headbands. So like you see, it's velvet and a lot of like your yarn or knit um, type material. But hey, you can definitely grab them. And then they also have like ponytail holders and barrettes as well. These will work great. Like if you have children that are in pageants that participate like in cheerleading, or if they just want to jazz up an outfit, $1, you cannot beat that. Now, here, these watches, guys, are ringing up $1.50. So look at this Bedazzle watch and the Wonder Woman watch. These are great stocking stuffers. These are great gifts to have for birthday gifts. Oh my gosh, you cannot beat that. Now, everyone was like, jewelry, we want jewelry, 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 jewelry. All right. All of this jewelry, it says that it's $3.50. It is ringing up $1 to $1.50. They have everything from different charms to necklaces to actually, um, what are they? The little bracelets. Okay, I could not think of it. I was gonna call them a wristlet, but they have bracelets, everything. They even had some items that are Disney items as well that you can get this kind of, I guess they kind of mimic the Pandora um, bracelets as well. So here, this is some jewelry. Now I know you're like, girl, that's not even a lot. That's okay. I'm gonna move over and let you see it all. Now these purses, some of the purses were ringing up for $2. Some of them were ringing up for $3. And then some of them were ringing up for, I think like $3.50. So nothing over here in this section section was more than three dollars with that being said the price tag on it still says nine dollars so you can see this one it says nine dollars seven dollars and I think it was even something that said $11, but that's why it's always great to have the app. And this is not a sponsored video because one of my subscribers had to get me all the way together. So now I am a believer in the app. So thank you, girl. You know who you are because you told me to start scanning and I'm glad that I did. Um, I did not purchase any of these purses or any of these items. It was just not my style. A few of the items, I think they have like some cross bodies that I may pick up, but I want them to go to a dollar. So like this one, they have like a cross body in the blue, maybe the actual wallets itself. So you see like the rainbow wallet or cosmetic pouch, they were a dollar. These little mini purses or book bags, those were $3. So I mean, I don't know what's taking it so long. And like this bedazzled one here, it was $3 as well. So not bad at all pricing that you can get now, but you see how much is left. So you know what? We'll just play, um, you know, peekaboo or tag because I'm not getting them right now. Okay. I'm going to wait. I have no problem at all with waiting. Now here is a mix and match set where you can actually get the bracelet and then you can get the charms as well. These were ringing up for $1. I am not a big jewelry person. Every now and then I'll jazz up my outfit with some items, but it's just not my thing. If anything, I would get something like this. Mother's Day is coming up and just put like a lot of them together. So this one is really cute. It's only $1 and those are like the cross. But if I were gonna give it to someone at my church or just females that I work with, you know, like if we came to work um, 
and had like something on their desk, I would do something like that. Like, you know, give it away to people or kind of create something just really nice and dainty for them. But, you know, I work from home. So who am I going to give it to? Myself? Hmm? I don't know. All right, so all of these little Disney charms and Disney bracelets were $1.50. And then as you can see, these are the longer necklaces. These were ringing up for $1.50 as well, but they are still marked $5. And so they had everything from single pendants um, to like just all different types. And so you see, once again, all of that was pretty much I would say under $5, that whole section. If you still need, for some reason, you still need gloves, they have this section. It's pushed over to the side. No one can see it. All these gloves are 50 cents. They have this. And then if we move over just a little bit, you can see there are some different colors, but all of these are 50 cents. I'm not sure why they have them hidden off um, like this. And that's probably why no one has purchased them but they are 50 cents as well. So now let's go over here because they have men's clearance socks for $3. These were some nice looking socks, especially for this full pack. Now you guys know if you watch the other parts of the videos, the or the other three videos, these socks will go down to a dollar, but it's like, do you want to take the chance? Let me know. Is $3 a good price for you? Let me know. Would you have purchased these socks for $3? I don't need any of the socks and I was able to get the female socks when they went to $1, but these will go to $1 and there are two pairs of socks. And these are more to me like, you know how the kids and the younger guys are in, into the crazy socks. It gives you, I guess, swag. Do they still stay swag? Am I old? I don't know. Well, it just makes you look more presentable if you don't know what swag is. Okay. <laughs> and then we're going to move over a little bit further. And then they have another cart here where this is $2 clearance as well. But this just looks like thermals and like your winter gear. So if you really don't need this, I would definitely just probably leave it. And this will probably go down to 50 cents because I just don't see people purchasing it at all. Um, but that's what they had going on for men. And then if we go down a little bit further, they must have had this whole rack complete for a dollar because you see it says one dollar and it has tank tops and different shirts but they are gone so i guess people purchase them now i went over to the food aisle because that was my original intent of being in walmart is to grab some food and then they had a lot of the food that was 50 cents um one dollar what was like a dollar below and so i heard these are some great penne noodles um, one girl I was watching, she's vegan or vegetarian. I don't know which one, but she was talking about these noodles and she claimed that they're good, but they were a dollar. And then they had like sugar cookies for a dollar. You can see they have McCormick spices for $1, which that rarely ever happens. Now I did not check the date cause I didn't want to touch it. Okay. And then, um, they also have like the cake decorating sets. Now, if you are a person that loves this Vita Coco or this coconut water type deal. They had these for 75 cents. They also had the aloe for 75 cents and then the sleep one for $1. Gravy mix for 50 cents. I mean, they had a lot of different food items and they were marking down in the store. So I didn't wanna stay because I just really didn't need any items. Now I thought these were like goo. If you're a runner, then you kinda know like sometimes they have little goos that give you electrolytes if you run a lot to kinda boost you out. It's a weird taste. I thought they were goos, but they are not goo. They are actual smoothies. So weird, and they were only a dollar, but I guess they will work. And then they had, like I said, the nut thins. These were $2 for like a six or eight pack. And then as we move down below, I do not know what this drink is. I've never seen it, but they had a lot of those. And then they have more sugar cookies. So the sugar cookies came in like blue, orange, red, pink. I guess it was for like your Easter um, on there. Now I picked these up. Matter of fact, I need to grab them because I want to try them. I picked these Thinsters up because I want to see, are they good or not? I mean, they were only a dollar and they were not expired. So I'm going to try them. Maybe I should do like a taste review. Like would you guys want to see me do like a clearance or a Dollar Tree food review? Let me know down in the comment section below because um, I do come across food on clearance. Sometimes it's stuff that I will try, but you know, I don't know. If you want, if you want me to do it, let me know down below. And if I can find some clearance food next time, I will definitely do it. All right, so moving along, this is some more clearance items and these are the bakery items. 
This would work well if you have someone that's celebrating a birthday or you just got that sugar tooth going on. How many of you guys been eating the snacks in quarantine? Like I've been snacking, but somehow I've lost weight. So I guess since I'm not eating out <laughs> at restaurants, I've lost weight. But you can see here that they actually have like the cheesecake and brownies and different pastries. And all of these items were less than $5. They even had bread and croissants and apple pies look at that and when i checked the date on these literally the date still was like up until like april 24th so it still had quite a ways which i was surprised that i'm like that's still almost mm, not necessarily a week just a few days you know but if you have children at home what better way to devour them and keep them up during school then a little bit of sugar all right so you can see here the cinnamon rolls and then they even had like the mini cupcakes these were one dollar and 28 cents like you haven't seen that look at this look at the muffins for two dollars and seven cents four pack of muffins you cannot be that like this is your time you're at home if you just want to make yourself feel like you are at a restaurant and have brunch you can pick you up some muffins cut you up some fruit you know have you a nice little orange juice sit out on the porch or the patio get some fresh air yeah am i setting the mood because that's exactly what i'm feeling okay that's exactly so these whole two racks was just full of the pastries and then last but not least is going to be the clearance aisle which our walmart always have a clearance aisle a clearance room just clearance okay and then on the clearance aisle they have makeup they have um body spray and i'm not gonna really slow it down for this just because a lot of times we have seen a lot of these items already but I kind of wanted to show people if you did not watch the previous videos that, um, you know, like you can just see some of the items that we have on clearance. So this looks like it's going to be a lot of men's sporting. So if you have someone that's into golf or swimming, um, those different items, they did have like goggles on sale. They had the golf balls on sale, gloves, and a lot of different items. Now for our ladies, they did have, once again, your sheet sets. Now I did scan and these were saying like the pillowcases were $8, but they were ringing up $5. And then you had your 300 count sheets. They said like $20, they were ringing up $15. So once again, the best thing to do is to scan and see exactly if the price is lower. Now, I didn't catch this, but probably around maybe a few weeks ago, um, one of the ladies was telling me or the store representatives was stating that, hey, those sheet sets went down to like two and three dollars. And I guess this was at the beginning of the whole pandemic and everyone was in the house. Now it seems like a lot more people are, you know, being out, you know to each his own every state is different so i'm not judging you have to do what you have to do over here they have more clearance items and these clearance items it looks like it was like your sunscreen and then not only did they have sunscreen they had like different lotions and different items these things were like six dollars or less so it wasn't just super inexpensive i'm not familiar with these brands to say if this was a great price or not but they did have these items and they were from neutrogena and a lot of different other ones so let me know if you tried these items down below all right guys so that is the end of this video please let me know in the comment section below would you like to see me do a taste test have you been to walmart and picked up some of the clearance what are you doing are you making breakfast are you cooking let me know let's just talk about it please like comment subscribe and yeah i will talk to you later in the next video bye